Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for October 24th of 2023 well, it is titled ARP 87 Merging Galaxies from Hubble. So what do we see here? Well, here we see two galaxies in the process of a merger. So these are two galaxies colliding and that affects the shapes of the galaxies and distorts them. So when galaxies collide, really the stars will never come anywhere near each other. And that's because the galaxies are mostly empty space. So the stars themselves will just pass right by and the gas clouds will collide and will be affected by the gravitational fields, which will enhance the star formation in both galaxies. So we see lots of blue here and that blue is young stars and young star clusters that have formed. So likely these two galaxies have passed very close to each other and that gravity has induced more star formation during that. Now we see how this material kind of is bridged between the two. So they seem to almost be connected, which again gives us the idea that maybe they actually already passed through each other and are going uh, back and forth and will eventually merge down into one single galaxy. Now that that will not happen in a very fast manner. It will take a long time for this to occur. Hundreds of millions of years between each pass and they would slowly occur faster and faster until eventually the two galaxies would be together and would merge into one larger galaxy. So that will happen and that is actually how galaxies grow over time. Early in the history of the universe galaxies were very small, much smaller than the large galaxies we see today. And over time galactic collisions like this have allowed those galaxies to grow into the much larger spiral and elliptical galaxies that we see today. So we see these two spiral galaxies in the process of a collision. We also see another spiral galaxy off to the left, which is not associated with these. It actually is a greater at a greater distance and is not involved in these. So we can get an idea of that by various measurements. We could measure the distances and how that compares to this these galaxies, which are about 300 million light years away. And the other spiral galaxy we know is not distorted at all. So is likely for whatever reason not involved in this collision. Probably that it is actually very distant well beyond these other two galaxies and just visible in the same direction in the sky but well off behind the two galaxies that we see merging today. So that was our picture of the day for October 24th of 2023. It was titled ARP 87 Merging Galaxies from Hubble. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.